Hi there, welcome to another edition of Sienna NDI Tools for Mac. Today we're going to take a look at NDI Weblink, which is an HTML gateway for NDI, which allows you to monitor your NDI sources on a web browser, uh, any web browser on any device, including mobile devices such as iPhones. Weblink is really, really easy to use. It's mostly one-click operation. It's got two basic modes. It's got a super low latency video only mode, which you can use for things like source monitoring, particularly if you wanted to be monitoring on a mobile phone whilst you're editing social media content, things like that. But it's also got a HTTP live streaming. That's an Apple HLS mode, which is more useful for uh, streaming to a large audience across your local network with audio and video. Let's take a quick look at the low latency mode to start with. So if I go into NDI Weblink, we can see we've found eight NDI sources on our network already. That's going to be my TriCasters on the local network. And we can click this source monitor button, or you can go to this URL in any other web browser. And what you'll see is this window, and you can click on it, and you can pick a source. So if I choose mix number three, we're going to see our TriCaster mix three, and there it is. It's coming right out of there. We can compare that with the NDI monitor running the same thing. And you can see that it's very, very low latency. It's basically the same latency you'd get in a low latency NDI monitor. Uh, there's no audio in this, but it's got scalable quality and it's very low latency. Uh, the other mode we've got is the HTTP live streaming mode. Um, and what we can do is either click on this button here or you can go to it in, um, in the web browser. And again, if we choose our mix number four, say for example, then it takes a little bit to cache because this is using HTTP live streaming, which you can learn about on the web. Um, and it's what's used for a lot of uh, TV delivery and other kind of live streaming uh, operations. It's about a seven or eight second latency, but it gets you great quality of video and audio. And we can click on that. And now we're watching our NDI source via HTTP live streaming. Um, might be nice to have a quick look at what this um, seems like inside it's something like an iPhone. So I've got an iPhone simulator here just to show you. We can click on the NDI Weblink favorite and we can click on JPEG to get a low latency video. And we can choose our source that we're interested in, Mix3 in this case. And here it comes and we can rotate the picture to watch it full screen on the iPhone. So this is now your NDI source appearing on an iPhone. Uh, same thing for an iPad, and it even works on things like high-performance smart TVs and any other device that's got a web browser. You can also access NDI sources on other subnets using this NDI access button, and you just type in the IP addresses of any uh, NDI devices that aren't on your local subnet, um, and NDI Weblink will discover the NDI sources at those addresses. The other thing you can do is, and um, we've shown you the HLS live streaming system uh, once already, um, it's very useful for a new concept called local casting or personal CDN, where you want to share an NDI source on your local network with maybe lots of other people in the same company. Perhaps you're having a company meeting, like an all hands meeting, where you want to stream the events out to everybody in the company. And you probably want to send them an email telling them where to tune in when the meeting starts. And you can click on this uh, menu here called Get CDN Direct URL. And I can choose, for example, uh, a URL right here, which will take us to the HLS version of our TriCaster Mix 4. And you can email that to people. And when they get it, they can open their email. You can just click on it, just like this, and there we go, we've got ourselves a meeting. A few seconds later, once it's started caching, your viewers are going to be able to tune into your meeting, and everybody's now watching over the network. That's pretty much it. It's a very, very simple and easy to use product. It's available from the App Store, the Apple App Store. And also you can get more information from sienna.tv slash NDI. Thanks for tuning in and please join us next time on Sienna NDI Tools for Mac.